Get a mark every time my stomach gets hurt or get a mark every time my stomach speaks? Get a mark every time my stomach gets hurt. If I choose get a mark every time my stomach speaks, my face is going to be filled with marks. So, get a mark every time my stomach gets hurt. Bye mom, I'm going to school. Did you make your choice? Hopefully you picked something to help you find your soulmate easily. I chose to get a mark every time my soulmate gets hurt. But your face is so clean, you have no marks yet. Yeah, I'm grateful he's okay. Anyways, I need to get to school. See you later. Hey guys, why are you all looking at me like that? Wait, you didn't notice, your face has a huh? mark. That means my soulmate got hurt this morning. No need to panic, maybe it's just a scratch. Yeah, true. Hey babe. We need to break up. What? Why? We've been dating for almost two years. You're not my soulmate. You've got two marks and I didn't injure myself two at all marks? today. Yeah, so I'm breaking up with you. But wait! <sighs> Why the hell is my soulmate hurt? Hopefully nothing bad happened to him. Just calm down. Nothing will happen to your soulmate. Why are you so sure? Because as long as the mark is still there, it means your soulmate hasn't died yet. Unless the marks are gone. Gone? Yeah, when your soulmate dies, the marks disappear. I have to stop thinking about my soulmate. Amara, you're in a group with Amy. Really? Yeah, we're in the same group. Why so excited? We're friends, so it's more fun that we're in a group together. I have to find a guy who has two injuries. Amara, do you want to do the work at my house? Yeah, sure. <sighs> my soulmate's hurt again. Guys, have you seen a guy who might have hurt himself three times today? No, sorry. <sighs> How is this possible? I have to focus on the group work and stop thinking about this. Hey, Amara, come on in. Wow, your house is really big. Thanks. Who's that? That's my brother. You can't talk to him because he's a bit you weird. You never told me you had a brother. Do you always ask this many questions? I'm going to go make you a drink, okay? Okay. I wonder why Amy told me not to speak to her brother. He's kind of hot. Hey, I'm Amara. Are you Amy's brother? Yeah, my name is Lewis. Why are there three wounds on your arm? Because of Amy. Basically, you have to be careful with her. Huh? Why is her brother saying that? Amy, um, I'm just gonna go home, okay? How come? We haven't worked on the project yet. Uh, I'm not feeling too well. Maybe we can work on it tomorrow. Why are there so many marks on my face? Hello, Amy? Don't forget to come to my brother's funeral today, okay? Wait, what? Funeral? Why is there so many marks on my face? Hello, Amy? Don't forget to come to my brother's funeral today. Wait, what? Funeral? Yes. But your brother was fine just yesterday. After you left, he fainted and died. Anyways, I'll see you later. But my face still has marks. That means he's not dead yet. Hey, Amy. Why do you have so many marks on your face? Yeah, my uh, stomach's hurt. Perhaps? Perhaps what? Um, nothing, nothing. Why do I feel like Amy's trying to hide something? Gosh, that's a lot of marks on your face. Yeah, I'm trying to find my soulmate. Looks like your soulmate isn't doing too well. Did you know that Amy's brother died? Yeah, I do. Why? Why aren't you sad? Because I feel like her brother hasn't died yet. What makes you think that? I saw he had three wounds on his arm yesterday and my face still has marks, so I guess he hasn't died yet. But you have to make sure that Amy's brother is your soulmate. Yeah, true. Mom, I'm home. Lewis? How do you know Amy's brother's name? It says Lewis on your forehead. First the marks and now his name? He's definitely my soulmate. But isn't Amy's brother dead? I don't know. Sorry, Mom, but I have to go. I hope Amy's still awake. Hey, Amara, what is it? Hey, sorry to bother you at night, but um, I forgot my book here last night. Okay, come on in. Where's the book? Um, I think I forgot where I put it. Can I go inside to look for it myself? Okay, but don't be long. Lewis. Lewis. Where is he? Did something just break? Amara, what are you doing here? I was looking for my book. I just remembered. We don't need books for this project. So why are you really here? Oh yeah, right. My book is at home. Why are you covering your forehead anyway? Because it's, um, cold. Take it off now. Lewis, why do you have Lewis written on your face? Because my soulmate's name is Lewis. Your soulmate's not my brother, right? Isn't your brother dead? How could it be your brother? The marks disappears when someone dies. Unless he's not dead yet. It's late, Amara. You should probably go home. I'm sure Amy's brother's my soulmate. I just wish he could give me another sign. Your face is filled with marks and you're still asking him to give you a sign? Here, take the stick. What's this stick for? You need to use it to kill whoever's been trying to hurt your soulmate. Once you kill them using the stick, your soulmate's wounds will heal. 
Mom, I'm home. Gosh, honey, your face. What's wrong with my face again? You have marks on your face. I already know that. But this time the marks are blue. Huh? Blue? Do you know what the blue marks mean? No, I don't. I have to call the police. They're the only ones who can help him. Hello, officer, can you please help me? There's a guy named Lewis. He's in danger. Can you please help him out? Okay, sure. Give me the address. I'll have a look. Look at her marks. Why are they blue? Oh, it's dangerous if they What blue. if the mark is blue? What happens? It means it's not an ordinary wound. Your soulmate almost died. Almost died? <sighs> officer, you came just in time. Is it this house? Yes. Okay, let's knock first. If no one answers, we'll break in. Why isn't she answering? Yes, my aim was perfect. Oh my gosh, what did you just do? You really think a police officer can stop me? You better go home, Amara. Where's Lewis? I'm pretty sure he's still alive, right? If you don't want to end up like this police officer, you better go home. Amara? What? How did you escape? <sighs> Lewis, I'm so sorry. I didn't know you were my soulmate. Hmm, or should I just kill you both? Amy, please, don't hurt Amara. You're so kind, Lewis. Amy, you have to apologize to your brother. I don't like him. Mom loves him more than me. You don't know what the stick is, do you? No, what is that? Since you don't know, I'll show you. Amara, all the wounds on my body are gone. Hey, honey, can you tell me what name you've got above your head? Princess. Stop messing around. I'm serious. What does it say? No, I'm not. It says princess. Whatever. I'll just ask you when you get older. Hey, princess, where's your prince? Haha, <laughs> very funny. We all know you're lying. Why would I lie about something like this? It really says princess. Yeah, in your dreams. Let's go, guys. Are they bullying you because of the princess thing? Wait, you don't believe me either? I want to, but the real princess is at the palace right now. I don't even know anymore. Hey, mom. Hey, honey, can you turn on the TV for me? Yeah, sure. Should I order some food? The palace has released a statement about the dethroning of the princess. The queen has found out she's not her real daughter. Smart pill or power pill? I want to be smart. Mom, I'm going to school. I have a really important test today. Why do you even bother going? Everyone in this family failed because we're not very academic. Going to these tests are a waste of time. But I... No buts. Next semester, make sure you pay for your own course because I'm not paying for it anymore. It's useless. Hey! Oh my gosh, look who it is. Why do you even bother coming to school? You keep getting low grades in every exam. Stop wasting your parents' money and just quit. Well, I've been studying and I have a good feeling about this exam. Oh, I almost feel bad for you. I actually think you're going to pass. Whatever, I'll show you. You have one hour to complete the test. No cheating, please. She's definitely going to fail. I don't even know why she bothers. Well, what they don't know is that I've taken the smart pill, so there's no way I could fail. Amara, is this your paper? Yeah. You got 100 out of 100. Well done. <laughs> Sir, she brought a cheat book with her. Is that true, Amara? Answer truthfully. In that case, I'm giving you two biology questions to Wait, answer. Wait, like right now? Yes, right now. Whoever has the highest grade gets a prize. And the one with the lowest grade will be suspended. Good luck at failing, Amara. <laughs> Whoever has the highest grade gets a prize. Whoever has the lowest gets suspended. Good luck at failing, Amara. You only have 60 minutes. Make sure you answer all the questions. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. This test is so easy. There's five minutes remaining. Hurry up. Done, sir. I'm also done. I'm sure I got all the questions right. Look, isn't that Amara? Yeah, she's so brave for challenging Gemma. Isn't she in like rank one? Let's see what you all have to say after I win. Better say goodbye to the school, Amara. I can't wait to see your face after the results come out. And what if I win? That's not possible. My whole family is filled with doctors and lawyers. And what's yours? Both your parents are cleaners. I'm surprised they're still paying for your course. I'm sure I'm going to win, right? We'll find out later. The results are in. Please come and see what your scores are. Who won? It was me, right, sir? People will disappear every time you sneeze or blink. I hate people, so... Blink. That way they can disappear quicker. Let's see how many people are left. 10,000? Whoa, looks like there's a lot of people living in the small town. I have to get rid of them quick. That way I can have this whole town for myself. Honey, what are you doing? I'm trying to get rid of everyone as quick as I can, mom. What? So you're the one who got that option? Yeah, why are you shocked? Don't tell anyone and please be careful. 
Don't worry, Mom. I'm going to make sure you don't disappear. You can't control who disappears because it happens randomly. What? Hey, bestie. Hey, um, can I just ask, how many times does a person blink per day? 20,000 times. That means everyone's going to disappear today. Why are you No, asking? um, it's nothing. Okay, anyway, what I was going to tell you was... Wait, did she just disappear? Be careful. I heard the person responsible for everyone's disappearances in the school. How do you know that? It doesn't matter. You have to help us catch that person so we don't disappear. We don't have much time. Okay, class. I'm sure you all heard about the rumor. Sir... But, um, what if it's fake? It's not fake. We all have to work together to find whoever's responsible for this. Yes, we have to kill them. How are you going to find them? It's easy. We're just going to have to test everyone. Whenever someone blinks and another person disappears, that means it's them. Okay, it's your turn, Amara. Please blink. Why aren't you blinking? I'm going to get caught. I have to blink fast so that everyone disappears before they kill me. I feel so lonely. Now I have to live alone, eat alone, and sleep alone. It's so boring. Wait, there's still some people left? Yes, I have to find them. <coughs> I just heard something. I think it's coming from that house. Okay, I can't blink anymore, otherwise I'll stay on this earth alone forever. Finally, Amara's here. How do you know my name? Finally, Amara's here. How do you know my name? I want to thank you because you eliminated everyone. What do you mean? Now, the world can be mine. Your power doesn't work on me, it's useless. What? All I wanted was to live alone and be independent. I didn't want to mess up the world like this. Oh yeah, there's still three people left. Me, that guy, and I still need to find one more person. Hello, is anyone there? This is useless. I'm never going to find them. What do you mean? Isn't it just me and you left? Who are you looking for? Um, no one. I'm just bored. Okay, you're going to be my assistant for when I rule the world. Assistant? This guy is crazy. Yes, do you have a problem with that? No, not at all. At least my house is still here. I can't believe I made my mom disappear. Wait, she left a note. With an address? Maybe it's a clue. Okay, I'm here at the address. Hello. Yes, I found you. Can you please help me save the world? We can't fight that guy. He's too powerful, but I can help you bring everyone back to this world. Wait, how are you doing that? Why did the numbers get stuck? It's because you blinked, so they disappeared again. Okay, I have to stop blinking from now on. Turns out there's still some people left. What are you doing? Now the world will be mine. Are you going to kill me too? No, I'm not. You're valuable. What am I going to do now? There's one more thing you can try. Try blink three times, he should disappear. <gasps> it worked! So, what now? You have to sleep. That way I can bring everyone back to this world. Okay, in that case, I'm going to sleep now. Amara! Amara! I've called you a hundred times and you didn't hear me. I'm tired of calling oh, you. Oh, sorry. I didn't hear you, Mom. I need to get your hearing sharpened. Huh? Guys, my sense of hearing is getting sharpened, so you can't whisper around me anymore. What? Seriously? Yes, it was my mom's choice. Does that mean your ears will change too? Change? What do you mean? Yeah, they're gonna look weird. Oh, look, they already did. Why are my ears so long? I feel bad for her ears. They're so long, they make her look ugly. Why are you so rude to me? Huh? I was whispering. How come you heard that? So, I can hear everything now? Is this even a good thing? I should probably give the class a sudden exam. Sir, please don't. I haven't studied yet. What? I didn't even say anything out loud. I was just thinking it. I can hear people's thoughts? Um, sorry. No, maybe I heard wrong. Well, since I got caught, I'll just cancel it. Jess, I think there's something wrong with my ears. What's wrong? I think I can hear people's thoughts. If that's true, try listening to that new guy's thoughts. Okay. So, can you hear anything? Nope, nothing at all. Those ears attract a lot of attention. Yeah, I know. My ears are different than the others. No, not because of that. You can hear people's thoughts. How did you know that? I'm going to help you hear the new boy's thoughts. Sir, where did the new student come from? I don't know, but you have to be friends with him. You want me to be friends with him? Yes, you're good at making friends. Plus, I want you to get some information from him. But why? It doesn't matter, just do what I say. The school must be hiding a big problem. 
Hi, nice to meet you. So you're new here, right? He won't understand you. He only talks in sign language. Yeah, I'm new here. If you want to get to know me, meet me after school. Wait, so you can talk? I know you can talk. You just pretend to be mute. I want to take you somewhere and you're going to have to listen to people's thoughts. What? No, I'm not going to listen to anyone's thoughts. Just trust me, you're not going to regret it. We have to break into this house. But this is our teacher's house. I don't want to. I could get expelled. Just do it for everyone's sake. What's wrong with this house anyway? I think there's people outside. We need to leave this place right now before we get caught. Run! No, if we run, we won't be able to hear the teacher's secrets. You listen then. I'm not trying to get caught. Just one more time, please. You won't regret it. Someone's definitely listening to our conversation. No, I can't. I need to go home. Mom, I'm home. I saw that test you hid under the bed. You got an F? You're so dumb. You don't have to shout. My ears hurt. You're lucky I don't ground you. You should be ashamed of yourself. Sis? What? Why were you outside the teacher's house listening to a conversation? Why were you there? Oh, um, he helps me with homework. Private lessons? Seriously? Isn't that weird? Nope, not at all. Why are your ears smaller than before? They are. Maybe because you're abusing them. I don't care if I lose my ears. It'll be better for me because then my friends will stop using me. Wait, wait. Wait? What do you mean? The more you use your ears, the more likely they'll disappear. That's exactly what I want. But if that happens, you'll never know what the new kid wants from you. Yeah, you're right. Did you get any information about that child? Yes, sir. Yesterday he took me to your house. Huh? To my house? No wonder I was hearing people outside. What were you guys doing? He told me to listen to your conversations, but I don't know why. Good. Keep reporting to me, okay? I will now announce the test results. Sarah, you got the highest grades in class. Sarah, my sister? New kid, you got the second highest. You have to go to your teacher's house again to get proof. What proof? That he's helping your sister cheat on the exam. The new kid deserves to be ranked number one in your class. Your teacher has really bad intentions. You look so beautiful today with that dress. I think the teacher's with his wife. Congratulations on being ranked number one in class today. Ranked number one? That means... Sarah, what are you doing here? What do you think? You're going out with the teacher? You should be ashamed of yourself. I have to find the new kid. Don't worry, I've already called the police and they've arrested the teacher. But how? You don't have any proof. Yesterday when you left, I installed a camera in his house, so I have all the proof that I need. You're a genius. I hope my eyes are black just like my other friends. What? Rainbow? What does that mean? Honey, put it on private. Let your friends be curious. It's more fun. Okay, mom. My eye color is black. Mine's green. What's yours, Amara? Um, they're black. But why are you wearing sunglasses? Because uh, I'm tired today. I didn't put any makeup on. Okay, well, guys, I have to go. I'm sorry. I can't be seen with you because my eyes are green. My rank is higher than yours. Why do some people have green eyes? What does that mean? Whoever has blue eyes are part of the royal family, while whoever has black eyes are just ordinary people. A part of the royal family? Yep, that's right. Why is this guy locked up like that? Because he doesn't have an eye color. So? So, for example, if you don't have an eye color, you'll be considered useless and they'll put you in prison. I have an eye color, right? Because I don't want to end up in prison like that person. Why are you wearing sunglasses anyway? Are you hiding your eye color? No, uh, my mom says I have an eye infection, so I have to wear these glasses. Are you sure you're not hiding something? Because your eye color is private. Why aren't you saying anything? No reason. Hmm. Does rainbow mean that I don't have a specific eye color? That's why my mom told me to put on these glasses, so I won't be put in prison. Hey, if I tell you something, do you promise not to tell anyone? Of course. I don't know if I have an eye color. I got rainbow. If you're curious, why don't you just take off your glasses? <sighs> because I'm scared. I don't want to not have an eye color. Don't worry. Just trust me. Take your glasses off. Oh my gosh. Are my eyes black? No, they're... Everyone, please gather for an eye color check. Huh? An eye color check? I have an eye color, right? You do, but... If that's the case, I don't have to be scared to get checked again. Before all examinations, please go public with your eye color. Luckily, I have an eye color, so no need to be afraid.
Amara, why is it loading? My friend just told me I have an eye color, sir, but I don't know which one yet. If you really have an eye color, please take off your glasses. Okay, I'll remove them now. I hope nothing bad happens. Take the glasses off. Okay, I'll take it off. I really hope nothing bad happens. Oh my gosh, why is your eye color? Why is my eye color what? Your eyes are not normal, they're colorful. Colorful? I finally found someone with this eye color. Officer, take her. What's happening? Shut up, don't move. Sir, why am I being detained like this? I'll leave you with this officer because I really need your eyes. They can help me. Help you with what? You're just going to leave me with a stranger? Let me go. Shut up. You wait until me and your teacher come back. So I'm going to be left here alone? Don't try to run away. But please. Amara, are you okay? <sighs> Emily, finally you came. Please help me untie these handcuffs. You shouldn't have went to the eye exam. Everyone's after you now. Everyone's after me? Yes, because only your eyes can see the contents of the box. What box? I'll explain later. Come with me now. Basically, your eyes have the power to see what's inside the box. People with normal eyes don't see anything. I don't understand. It. What box are you talking about? Our teacher, he always has this orange green box in class. Do you remember it? I think so. So, do you have the box? No, but we have to get it quickly from our teacher's classroom. This is our classroom, but the box is no longer here. It was here just yesterday. It seems that the teacher has taken it to the warehouse at the time you were kidnapped. So what are we going to do now? He thinks you're still in the warehouse. He must have came in and took it. How are we going to get it back? Don't worry. The box is useless if people don't know what's inside. The contents can only be seen with your eyes. Wait here. I'm going to try find it. I know where the teacher's box is. You do? Yes, I'll show you, but you have to come Okay, let's go. Emily, I'm with Olivia. She says she knows where the box is. The box is with me now. You have to run away. She's lying to you. Um, Olivia, I need to go to the bathroom. My stomach hurts. You think you can run away from me? Hey, guys, she's with me. Take her. Wait, don't. Hey, wake up. Finally, we managed to catch one of the colored eyed people. So what are we going to do, boss? Look for the box. Here's the box. See what's in it and tell me. No! You want to keep your eyes, right? I have no choice. Hurry up and open the box. Huh? Why is your face like that? What's in the box? Huh? Why is your face like that? What's in the box? It's empty. What? You're lying to me. What's in it? Tell me now. But I don't know what's in it. It's really empty. Don't lie. The box you have is the fake one, not the real one. You tricked me. Hurry up and give me the original box. If you let go of Amara, I'll give you the original box. Okay, but she's going to have to tell us what's in it first. Emily! Before I give you the box, can I have a word with Amara alone, please? Okay, hurry up. Thank you, Emily, for saving me again. No problem. Are you sure giving them the box is a good idea? We'll just give them a fake box again. You want me to lie to them? They won't even know we're lying because they can't see what's in it. Only you can. Okay, if you say so. Here you go, this is the box. Quickly, tell me what's inside. It's, um... Hurry! It's filled with diamonds. Hey, okay, now you two can go. Okay, come on, let's go, Amara. But are you sure they won't find out? It's time to wear these glasses, you're being targeted. People already know your eye color. If only I could find a girl with the colorful eyes. Excuse me, miss, do you know where the colored girl is? No, sorry, I don't. That's a shame. If I had known, I could have caught her. Emily, we have to leave the city. What happened? Everyone knows that the colorful eyes belong to me, so I have to leave the city immediately. It's easy then. Let's get out of the city. But what about the box? We have to get the box and take it abroad. Okay then, let's go get the box now. Let's go. This is the box. Just hold it. Why don't we just open it now? Why is there a helicopter here? Hey, girl with colorful eyes, we know you're there. We have to go now. They already know we're here. They've been chasing us this whole time. Let's go, Amara. You think you can escape from us, huh? <sighs> Sorry, please, let us go, just this time. Give us the box, otherwise we're gonna have to take you back to the warehouse again. Amara, quickly, open the box now and tell me what's in it. Um, three wishes. Give us the box now! Amara, hurry up and make a wish. Okay, my first wish is for me to leave the city. My second wish is for me and Emily to be the richest people in the world. My third wish is for my eyes to go back to normal color. Are you sure you want to let go of your power? Yes. So, did it work? I think so. <gasps> Mommy, my cheeks hurt. Why do I have to keep wearing these? Because, honey, you need to practice for when you go outside. It's important you keep smiling, otherwise they'll kill you. So I'm not allowed to show any emotions? No, it's strictly forbidden.
I'm so excited to go outside for the first time. Remember what I told you yesterday, okay? Whatever you do, do not stop smiling in public. Okay, mom, you told me like a thousand times already. Hey, I'm just making sure. I found it. No, there. I did. Mom, can you tell her to give me the teddy bear? Honey, give it to your sister. I'll buy you another one. <laughs> That's not fair. Why do you always love her more than me? Mommy, sister's crying. Hey, move out the way. Just keep smiling. Amara, I just saw Jake cheating on you with Emma. Wait, what? Yeah, he was kissing her on the science room. Are they still there? I think so. Well, look what we have here. Amara, it's not what it looks like. If they want to play that game, I'm going to make them stop smiling in public so they can... Cover my mouth or cover my heart? Choose mouth, now. Why, Mom? Don't you see that big fat mole on your face? It makes you look ugly. Okay, Mom. Finally, I can go to school again. Hey you, why are you covering your mouth? You're so weird. Maybe because she's ugly, that's why she chose to cover her face. <laughs> okay guys, has everyone found a date to prom? Yes, I'm going with my boyfriend. Must suck to be Amara, she's ugly and no one wants to go to prom with an ugly girl. Can you guys just stop bullying me? Not until you take off that mask. Yeah, take off your mask, I'm curious to see what you're hiding. We promise we're not going to bully you. Okay, okay, fine. I'll take off my mask. Before this competition starts, please remove your mask. Okay, I'll take off my mask now. Sandy, why do you have so many moles? What? This mask is supposed to remove them, not make them worse. Ugh, I'm so embarrassed. You said this mask would remove my moles. Why did it make it I'm worse? so sorry. I didn't know that the mask could only be used once. You didn't know? You have to be responsible. <sighs> Don't worry. I still have a lot of masks at home. Mom, I'm home. Uh, what's up with your face? What do you mean, Mom? Here, have a look. Huh? What? Why do I have so many moles on my face? Did you borrow the mask to someone else? <sighs> yes, I borrowed it to Sandy. You what? You weren't supposed to do that. Where is the mask now? I don't know. I threw it away in the bin. Well, go search for it before anyone else finds it and uses it. Your whole face will be covered in moles. I've searched everywhere, but I can't find it. Are you searching for a mask? I saw a guy take it from your backyard. What guy? Here's the medicine. Thank you. You're very kind. My status? It doesn't say error anymore. Hey, Gardner, what are you talking about? It must be fake. You're the one who's fake. I'm going to make you regret saying that. I heard you're the new school queen. Yeah, Emily was lying this whole time. We always believed you. Let's be friends, please. I don't want to be friends with you guys. You're evil. And besides, aren't you Emily's best friends? Not anymore. We don't want to be friends with Emily. We want to be friends with the queen. So your status appeared. You're the real queen. I'm so happy. Jake, don't believe her. According to the rules, the king must obey the queen. What do you want, queen? I want Emily's status to be changed to gardener. Okay, fine. I admit I lied about my status, but please don't change it to gardener. You deserve to get the punishment. I can see someone's last drink or last meal. I think their last meal is more interesting. Mom, I'm going to eat quickly before going to school. Oh my gosh, you ate a cockroach? Yeah, I wanted to try it. I learned how to fry it online. Do you want to try some? No, thank you. I'm going to school. Bye. Wait, before you go, here, take a couple with you so you can eat them at lunch. Whatever, Mom. Thanks. It turns out all my friends are healthy because they eat vegetables all the time. Amara, what's that in your lunchbox? What kind of food is that? It looks delicious. The fried cockroaches. Do you want to try some? Sure, I've never had them before. I heard they're really good. Thank you for sharing your lunch. You're usually very stingy. I feel bad for you because you eat vegetables all the time. How do you know that I eat vegetables? Because I can see people's last meal. If that's true, can you check my last meal? Chicken liver? Gosh, you're right. But please don't tell anyone I have this power. I feel like everyone who ate your cockroach yesterday is gone. Huh? Gone? How? They didn't come to school today. Who made that cockroach? My mom, but it's impossible that she would poison my lunch. The teacher now suspects you. Luckily, I didn't try your lunch yesterday, so I'm saved. You wanted to see me, sir? Aria said you can see someone's last meal, right? But I told her not to tell anyone. Is that true, Amara? Yes, sir. Meet me at the school warehouse at 3 this afternoon. I wonder why he wants me to meet him at that exact time. Okay, sir. Why does it smell so rotten in here? You should see the last meal.
Huh? Them? That's my friends who didn't show up to school today. Why do they look so pale? Everyone who ate your cockroach died. One of them, as you know, is the president's daughter. There's no way. I guarantee my lunch wasn't poisoned. I need you to please look at the last meal. Huh? Why can't I see it? The last meal isn't appearing, sir. Okay, I'll give you three hours. If you can't prove it, you'll be found guilty and will be punished. Buy these glasses, please. They're cheap. No, thanks. I don't want to buy any glasses. But they have a great power. You won't regret it. Great power? Okay, who knows? Maybe they can help me. I'll take them. You're here, which means you can see people's last meals, right? I'll try, sir. This is your last chance. Okay, I'll put on these glasses first. So, what's the last meal? Gosh, so they really did die because of the lunch I gave them. Hello? Answer me! Um, it wasn't because of me, sir. The last meal was... chicken soup. Okay, now, keep this a secret from everyone. So, I'm not in trouble, right, sir? No, but please keep this a secret. Yes, of course. Where did you just come from, Amara? I was just walking around the school. I'm really starting to get worried about our friends. Do you think something bad happened to them? No, I don't think so. Honey, you're back from school. Let's have lunch. I just cooked. What's our lunch this time? Cockroaches. Why? I don't know if I should eat it, but I need to find out if the reason my friends died was because of them. You don't want to eat the food? Yes, I do, Mom. Well, it tastes really good, doesn't mm -hmm. it? Why didn't anything happen? I'll get it. Hey, I brought you a bag filled with food. You did? I don't think I can accept this, sir. If you don't, I'll reduce your grades. Okay, I'll accept it. Why is he forcing me to take this? This is so weird. I have to find out who was responsible for what happened at school yesterday. Amara, you're finally here. Huh, Stephanie? How are you still alive? Am I in heaven? I'm still alive and we all need your help to avoid the teacher. So you faked your death? Yes. <laughs>